Good day guys and welcome to this video. In today's video, I'm showing you how to use Shading Drift for your screen now. So before we proceed, I'm sure if you like this video, subscribe to this channel, leave a comment in the comment section, share this video, and also contact us for ads and collaborations for the description of this video. So guys, let's proceed. So now first, let's head over to our trading view. So now on our trading view, now let's quickly head over to a chart. So now I'll just select a pair. Let's select a pair now. Let's launch these charts. And after launching this chart, now the next thing we need to do is now you see on, on the bottom of your screen. Now let me zoom this a bit. On the bottom of your screen, now you see this stock screen. Now. Okay. And you also see this. So now just select, make sure you're on this stock screen now. Then as you can see now over on this stock screen now um you can manually refresh this refresh just every 10 seconds or every 10 minutes okay so um so on this also sorry guys let me try scrolling down so as you can see you can refresh this chart on this overview you can see you can save a column okay you can check see our column on this also. Sorry guys, this so now on this over here now you can search for sorry on this now you can download or export that section you can download or export export okay on this now you can see the time frame over here you're on the one day time frame you can change the time frame to like one hour or any specific one on this on this now but for this future now you can select um you want to see pairs maybe the top gainers the top losers or whatsoever you just filter as you can see now so okay so now this now will change okay so now you can select a market okay select which market select the market depending on your preference so now if you come over here to filters okay so now we can filter this uh, currently we have one six nine six matches okay as you can see we are so we are filtering this so as you can see if you want to add more specific filters okay i can filter by maybe let me see um by this change i will just select maybe i want only just nasdaq Okay, I just proceed now. So and I just close this. If I come back to this now, you see this has been brought into 828 matches. Okay, so now this uh, forest screen now it just helps you filter your your chart to more specific pairs. Okay, maybe you want to see only specific pairs which will come daily for your analysis and the rest. Okay, this filter just give you specific pairs okay you don't want to see hundreds or thousands of pairs okay maybe you just want to see 10 specific space depending on so you just filter this bring down bring the list down to a smaller amount of pairs so you can it can help you analyze and trade better okay so guys that's basically it for this video please don't forget to like subscribe leave a comment in the comment section share this video and also contact us for some collaborations at the description of this video so guys thanks for watching have a lovely day stay safe and i love you all peace